Hi, I'm Susan, and today I'm participating in week 35 of the Marguerite Miller Collage Challenge. And our prompts for this week is an illustration from a children's book. So I've got this from the fairy book. A hexagon. I just kind of made my own. I'm not very good at it, but there she is. And it said brown a craft paper. So I just made it on the craft paper or the brown paper. Uh, name of a favorite tea. I've got this apple cinnamon. Um, a string of numbers. I've got... A variety of ones. I'm not sure which I'm going to use or I may use them all. And a bonus is a fragrant item from your surroundings. And so I've got these roses. So I hope everybody's doing great. And without further ado, let's get started. Well, I'm doing pretty good. I can't complain. Let's see how we're going to do this. So I already got my background paper down and I've already inked. So... I'm just going to do some some decorating, I think. Oh, I kind of like it better here. Maybe something like that. Um, I think I'll use this side. Oh, lost some of my teeth. Smells good. All right. Thumb got stuck. So I think I'm just going to kind of do something like that. And maybe, um, you so I like that maybe something here to bring the color around let's see here I have these little doilies I got in happy mail could tuck those in around. And maybe still add some more numbers. And I've got this cute little ticket. I kind of like that. So let's get started. Well, there's not a whole lot going on. We have had some wonderful weather here in Mississippi for August, but I am afraid that it is just going to get hot again. We've had some 50 degree nights, and that is wonderful. But it's supposed to be hot and dry this weekend, and we're supposed to start getting temps back up into the 90s and the uh, 100, so... We'll see. We desperately need rain. Let's see here, get that down. Grab a paper towel to help me here. Okay. Let me tuck. I don't know, man, I like that color. It shines a little bit better. I think I'll do that side. I didn't realize it was double-sided. Alright. Do that. Go ahead and get this down. Well, I'm on, I think it's Book 8 of the Vampire Knitting Club. It's fun. It's great. They're fun books. Cozy mysteries. No sex. No gore. 
a little bit of a romance, not over the top. See, we finished Sherlock and we started watching the unit. It is pretty good. We just watched the first show yesterday. And um, so it seems like my husband's in my kind of show. I'll do that over that. Ah, no problem. Let me do this one first. And now I can put this one down. problem. You lay it out, but you never remember where everything went. It's the hardest thing about cutting out some of these books is you have pretty images on both sides. I think I'll put that somewhere like that. Yeah, like that. Let me get this one down. We'll take it down. And my other numbers. And I think I'll put this one over here. do, if I can find them, I thought I had some leaves, but I don't know, we may not need them. Got that cute butterfly. I'll add that. I'm not going to add it over here. I wish I knew what happened to my leaves. Now, I'm going to use my shimmer sticks and let's see, do their wings. Very pretty.
knuckle hold splatters. top in my glue before it dries out. side as well. Alright. Well, there she is. I like it. I hope you do as well. So, we have got our illustration from a children's book. Got our hexagon. You can't really tell back there, but that's okay. Brown or craft paper. I got the brown paper. The name of a favorite tea. I've got that. A string of numbers. I've got that and that. And even that right there. And a bonus is a fragrant item from your surroundings. And I've got these roses. So I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please give me a thumbs up. Hit that subscribe button if you haven't. Ring that bell so you can be notified when I upload new content. Leave a comment. Tell me what you think. Y'all have a great and wonderful day. Be sure and check out Marguerite Miller's channel. And be sure and check out the hashtag 2024CW35 to see what everyone else has made. Y'all take care. I love you. And until next time, bye y'all.